Uh, my name is Sivan Levy. I came here from Israel uh, three years ago. And I feel like I'm talking to you straight in the eyes and it's not working. So let me talk there. All right. When I was 12, um, it was my first tour. I went to Germany. And um, I make a list of uh, things I want to do in my life. And one of them was after I do like my theater and like perform a big artist, um, I want to kind of um, travel and I travel all over basically uh, with my dance group. And um, then what happened was that at the end of the list I said, okay, New York City is the place to make it. And that's what I did, I came here. Uh, basically when I moved down here, um, I start choreographing, you know, dancing with artists. Uh, that was kind of my dream, to come here, dance with Janet, Beyonce, you know, all these big artists, like that's the shows on MTV that I used to, do, to see in Israel. Um, this, the people I look up to, which is like Britney Spears, whatever. Um, I, really, I really like, to, like to, to see people perform and kind of shine through, like kind of see, you see their faces. Uh, this is one of the things that kind of it was in the back of my head. This is what I wanted to do, but um, I kind of find out like after I start choreographing here in the U.S. Um, I did some stuff with a couple of artists, and I really, really like. I was like, I can do this, you know. Like this is my role because I always kind of outshine other people, and I'm not saying I'm better or anything. I'm just saying that like, really, like life is. It's, it's about energy and like once you know this the energy that for yourself and you also see other people kind of give you the feedback the same way I think that you should take it on it and like kind of although if you have a field that's really the place that you should be and kind of live for your full potential. So uh, after I did a couple of like performances I decided that like that's it I gotta start to like kind of step the game up. Something that I always ask people that I see I'll be like yo what's your dream you know. Like, what is it that you're gonna do that makes you feel good? Not just about like going day to day and kind of go work, you know, um, nine to five or because it's necessary to, so you can make the money. More like, you know, what's really your dream? What's gonna get you out of bed every morning and you feel like you're blessed with life? Um, to me, when somebody asks you what's your dream, I think the things that really we want the most are the things that we scare the most. So that's where we should kind of start to question ourselves without living with a belief of like, okay, my mom says I can't do this, or my friend says I'm not good enough, or all these negative things, you kind of let it go, and like, go deep down within yourself, because at the end of the day, you know what you're capable of, and like, people can talk and do whatever, this, this is their journey, they choose their own path. You choose your own journey, and, it, journey and it's all come down to like choices in life. And um, really, belief system is something that you can totally change, and it changed over the years. Um, and thank God for blessing me to have the right people around and making me, like, not making me, actually leading me into something beautiful that is like beautiful journey that I'm at right now. So kind of choose from your fear, if it makes sense. Um, have, like, have like a list, make a plan, follow through. Like when you have a plan in front of you, to me, is that like, you don't really think about it, you see it visually, and it comes to reality.